now that we have discussed about surface area of a cuboid let's see how we can understand the lateral surface area of a cuboid a cuboid with its real life model today's session is about lateral surface area of a cuboid lateral surface area of a cuboid so here is a cuboid with length width and height now as we have seen that there are six faces one two three four five and six the top and bottom so if you add each of the six faces we get the total surface area or the surface area of this entire cuboid but if we just examine the top and the bottom faces and we go laterally along the side straight line along the side then such an area is called lateral surface area so the laterally surface area does not include the areas on the top and the bottom it includes only the surface area on the sides so face 1 plus face 2 plus face 3 plus face 4 make the lateral surface area this and this does not come into account so we understand that lateral surface area is the surface area of the cuboid which does not include the top and bottom it includes laterally the side faces so let's see in this session how to find the lateral surface area of a cuboid imagine i take a cuboid Now here this is the length this is the width and this is the height now as i include only the four faces but not the top and bottom this is not included and the bottom part is also not included only the face 1 face 2 face 3 and face 4 are included let's see how we can find lateral surface area of the cuboid so here the definition says lateral surface area denoted by lsa is the area is the surface area of the cuboid which does not which includes all the faces which includes surface area of all the faces except the top and bottom faces as how i understand the lateral surface area the area of the cuboid which includes all the faces except the top and bottom therefore using that definition of the lateral surface area therefore lateral surface area of a cuboid is given by lh and lh there and bh plus bh therefore i have only two times of lh plus bh i do not include the top and bottom which is lb so it has only lh plus bh is how we understand the lateral surface area of a cuboid 2 times lh plus bh the top and the bottom faces are exempted 
in lateral surface area. Now that we have discussed about lateral surface area of a cuboid, let's apply in a problem. So let's see the applications of lateral surface area, how to find the lateral surface area of a given cuboid. Applications of lateral surface area. This is for a cuboid. So let's see how we can find the lateral surface area of a cuboid as the applications. Here is a rectangular cuboidal box. And this is 10 meters. And this is 8 meters. And this is 5 meters. So let's see how the lateral surface area that is which covers only this region and this region but not the top and bottom the other two sides. So the question here is find the lateral surface area for the given So let's see how we can do it. As clearly we have the dimensions, my L is 10 meters, my B is 8 meters and my height is 5 meters. So I have my L, B and H which I am going to use in finding lateral surface area. So in this case lateral surface area of the given cuboid is given by the formula 2 times LH plus PH is what we have seen. So let's use this formula to find the lateral surface area. LH plus B H So this comes out to be LH plus B H and then 2 times 90 which is 180. Therefore, the area of the lateral surface area of the given cuboid is 180. Therefore, lateral surface area of the given cuboid is 180. meter squared. This is how we understand the lateral surface area which can be found using the dimensions of the cuboid. In this case the answer is 180 meter square. Applications of lateral surface area in to the real life models. If you like this video please give a thumbs up. Please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on CBSE syllabus.